From the subreddit Ask Reddit. What movie is a ten tenths? City of God. I can't really explain why because I haven't studied films and stuff. Amadeus. Alien, 1979. Clue 1985. One of the funniest movies I have watched and I still quote it in regular interactions. You can't make an omelette without breaking a few eggs. Every cook will tell you that. But look what happened to the cook dash. My cousin Vinny. Silence of the lambs no doubt. I really like one flew over the cuckoo's nest. The thing. Goodfellas. Stand by me. Terminator 2. C7EN. Blazing Saddles. Mel Brooks is an absolute genius. Saving Private Ryan. Spirited Away. Aliens. Jurassic Park, 1993. A true cinematic masterpiece. Tombstone. The Usual Suspects. Gattaca is a really cool watch. Not for everyone though. The Matrix. Monty Python and the Holy Grail. Psycho, Hitchcock. The original Back to the Future. Original idea to start with, flawless screenplay where everything happens for a reason, entire last half hour full of payoffs. Lord of the Rings. And life is beautiful. The Prestige, definitely blew my mind. Oh brother, where art thou? Truman Show. This is Spinal Tap is 11 tenths. DR, Strange Love. Wall Times E, 2008. The Green Mile. Indiana Jones and the Last Crusade. I just love it so much. The Shawshank Redemption. Princess Bride. Young Frankenstein. Princess Bride. Fencing, fighting, torture, revenge, giants, monsters, chases, escapes, true love, miracles. No Country for Old Men. The Mummy, 1999. Still remember opening night when my parents went to see it, but left me home with my grandparents because I was too young. Two years later, I was in the theater opening night for The Mummy Returns. Of course my dad found a way to show me The Mummy in the months prior. Two decades later, after literally hundreds of re-watches, I can't think of two films in a series I'd rather watch at any given time. Maybe nostalgia has something to do with that. But, at least in my eyes, The Mummy, 1999, still stands as the definition of a perfect monster movie.